Mami, por sole. Mami, por sole. Today is today. Today is today. Today. <laughs> no, no, no. That you um you had you 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 could you do. Today is today beautiful. Yes. Okay. Today is wonderful. It's a beautiful day. Es de wonderful. No nos van a arruinar la vida. Vamos por más. ¿Está escuchando, Robert? No te vas a salvar. ¿Ok? Te voy a dar el chanclazo, cabrón. De lo que te libraste. What's up, guys? I'm Mac, and this is going to be sort of a different video. I know it's been like a week. It's been a week since I've uploaded. Um, I took the week off because of an event that happened last week, Saturday, uh, last week, Tuesday, sorry, last week, Tuesday. Um, so basically what happened is um, my car got stolen. Yeah, crazy. They haven't found anything. The cops haven't found any. Haven't found my car. There haven't been any leads, no information. And at this point, I'm basically just. I've basically just given up on my car, and I just. I doubt I'm ever gonna see it again. To be completely honest with you guys. So yeah, let me tell you guys a story. So I guess this is a story video. So I'm gonna tell you guys how it happened what I was doing, what was it, you know, I'll give you guys all the details, and yeah, so, this comes to show you guys that anything could happen to anybody, and just be safe out there, so, just be careful guys, you know, just whenever you guys get robbed like this, just, it's better to just give them what they want, you know, so they don't hurt you, you're more important, you are more important than whatever they're trying to take, um, yeah, definitely, um, it's, it's dangerous out there, people are crazy, let's get to the story, um, hopefully you guys enjoy it, um, I mean, it's not, you know, a happy story, but, you know, I just want to let you guys know what happened, so, yeah, hope you guys enjoy All right, so I work at UPS. I'm a package handler at UPS, so I work every day. Usually start around, you know, two or three and get out late. Um, so this one, this Tuesday night, you know, it's all going normal. I'm at work. I'm about to get off. Cool, whatever. Um, my girlfriend. She asked me for some hot Cheetos, and, you know, well, I was, there was no problem, you know, I wasn't tripping, so I just, you know, I just uh, got off work, and I drove straight to Walmart. I stopped by, I got the Cheetos, and then, you know, I'm on my way home. Um, it was snowing this day, so, like, it was snowing, and the ground had, like, it was full of, like, not, like, snow snow, but, like, water snow. Like, you know, like, the, were like, the stuff, the gooey stuff. So it was, like, ugly. The day was, like, yeah, ugly. So I just, um, you know, got in my car, um, get on the highway, toward my house. And my girlfriend lives, like, literally down the street from me. So I basically got robbed, like, by my house. So, yeah. So I pull into her parking lot, and I park in her spot. I parked in her spot and I'm getting off the car right so I get off and I'm like halfway to her front door I'm halfway to it when I hear somebody behind me say give me the keys and I just like froze for like two seconds and I was like whoa so I, I turn around this is this dude with a ski mask you know, like those skis where you can really see the mouth and the eyes. So he's wearing one of those ski masks. I see the, a freaking gun in his hand. I kid you not. My neighborhood isn't even, it's not like dangerous, nothing. None of this, you never hear of somebody getting robbed at gunpoint. 
literally my neighborhood is just so small it's like a like townhouses so it's like all the houses look the same it's really small you know most of us like know each other here so then at the point where i see the gun i just kind of backed up a little bit i put my hands out like that and i was like i just told him to chill i was like whoa bro chill so then he asked for the keys again and he just kind of went like that like give me the keys at this point i was just like whoa dude this guy is about to kill me <laughs> so no exaggeration that's what i was thinking i just froze so then um you know just i just took the keys out of my pocket i gave them to him he just took off and since i wasn't even gonna like stay at my girls for for long i left my phone inside luckily i had my wallet in my pockets so that was good but you know my phone and i also had a pair of shoes in my bag so i lost a pair of shoes my car and my phone shoes car phone so this guy takes off um my girl calls the police right away because she was about to open the door for me and she saw how this guy just snuck up on me and she just closed the door i think i don't know i didn't see because it's like the, the door was to my back so i wasn't sure but she was opening it when i turned back around so you know she obviously closed it and then uh yeah this guy just takes off with my freaking car the cops get here um they're all like, you know, cops are fucking useless, man. Long story short, they haven't found my car. My phone was turned off too, so, you know, there was no way of tracking it. Tried to get in contact with Jeep, and Jeep said that um, I was supposed to be paying for their Uconnect service in order for them to be able to track it, which is kind of, you know, stupid just super unlucky to i don't have a car but my girlfriend's taking me to work um i don't go out whenever i do go to work i have to get a ride and it's just been bad so that's why i haven't really uploaded but yeah i just wanted to let you guys know that i got basically got robbed you know and i was just not feeling it for a while but you know, can't let these crazy dudes knock me off my game. So, you know, I'm back at it now. I got a new phone. Um, you know, I don't have a new car yet, but I'm probably just gonna, you know, save up a little money and buy a, you know, some simple, some slight. You know, just getting me, just to get me to from point A to point B. And yeah. I mean, my parents were freaked. My brothers were freaked. I mean, I guess they were, they were just glad that I came home safe because, you know, shit happens all the time. You know, there's some, there's some like, thieves that even after you give them your shit, they still hurt you. So, I'm glad that this guy wasn't like that. And I'm glad that, you know, I'm safe and I'm good and I'm here. You know, I gotta thank God for the for another day yeah guys just be safe out there and don't trust anybody mm, if you guys see some you know some strange some sketchy you guys don't have a good feeling about it just you know walk around or leave or you know just don't take a risk man it's not worth it so and if you do get um robbed like that you do get a gun pulled on you or a knife or whatever just hand over what they're asking for because it's not worth it getting hurt it's not worth it yeah so be careful out there my people just be careful and you know stay safe i'm gonna come back at you guys with another video soon I'm trying to think of something funny and awesome so you guys can have a laugh but yeah see you guys later